smack in the middle of the uh, old city of uh, Ljubljana in Slovenia stands this beautiful, massive, banana yogurt yellow cathedral of St. Nicholas, a beautiful Gothic church. This sculpture here in the side of this uh, humongous church, this is called a Pieta, it's the uh, depiction of uh, Mary with the uh, adult Christ after he died. This church was recently equipped with a couple of um, brand new bronze doors. This door depicts the uh, Christ reposing, dead, and with uh, six uh, bishops of uh, Ljubljana posing over him, or actually rising from him. That's the, that's the idea. This door was put in uh, and in the late 20th century. It's a brand new door. You see the uh, crowned Madonna and the crowned Christ in the corner over there. It's a really beautiful piece. The back end of the church is adorned with this beautiful fresco and it, it doesn't really say anywhere who this is. It's a, I think it's a late fresco. It looks like it's, it's modern. But uh, it's somebody getting called by an angel. So this can be John the Revelator or Daniel or even Ezekiel or whoever. And another mural, beautiful fresco of the, of the calling of uh, Mary. There's Gabriel with the, uh, the lilies, the sign of uh, purity. And God the Father with the signature triangular, well, aureole or whatever you want to call it, behind him. Some beautiful uh, statues also next to it, Joseph on top. It's a fabulous church. This church alone is worth visiting Ljubljana for. Beautiful, gothic, massive church. Also, the front entrance of this church was recently equipped with a uh, beautiful bronze uh, gate, a bronze door depicting the history of uh, Christianity in Slovenia. It's a massive, massive piece. Beautiful uh, relief. Really, uh, 